What's up guys, Rockin34 back with another mail day, and today we have mail from you guys, so let's see what you legends sent us, but before we get started, I've got, I've got the giveaway, five of these, I guess they're, what are they, character cards, they're not field centers, but they're from the Legendary Duelist Season 1, they're pretty cool, they're like hollow character cards, they're really, they're really nice looking, um, but I don't know exactly what to call them, but yeah, all you have to do is like the video, be subscribed and let me know your favorite piece of mail or item from this mail day to enter the giveaway. So yeah, let's get into it. I'm not sure when I'm posting this, but we're getting close to 18,000 and that's when we're opening TP2. So all you have to do is like or subscribe for that, not like. I mean, I guess you can like if you want, but let's get into this. There should be some pretty cool stuff from you guys. Let's see what we got. We're gonna go ahead and hop right into it. By the way, my tongue is still hurting. So if I still sound a little lispy, I apologize, but it's killing me. It's really killing me. <laughs> okay. All right, let's see if we can not show the address. Probably just did. Whoops. My address is fine because obviously my PO address is down in the description. So make sure you guys, if you want to send something, it's down there. You don't even have to ask me. A lot of you guys ask me, which is fine. But if you don't want to, it's right, it's right down there. All right, we've got a little note here, so that's good. It's always good when there's a note because then I know who it came from. And I don't have to like match it up with your address or your message or something. This makes it a lot easier. So here we go. Just pull this card of a pack and figure nobody else deserves it but you. Please enjoy this mega rare EN variant of everyone's favorite card, Yu-Gi-Oh! underscore TCG. Wow, an EN card. So that's promising. That means there's probably something really cool in here. And he just pulled it. I did get this like a week ago. So I usually, I, well, I'm going to try to wait for, you know, we have like four items here. So that's good. A good amount. Oh, wow. This thing is in a, it's in a screw down. Okay, let's see what card he sent us. So first of all, where's the note? Okay, this is from Yu-Gi-Oh underscore TCG. I assume that's it. I assume that he means Instagram right on there. Okay, here we go. So first of all, we have Bubonic Berman. That's pretty sweet. Ho oh, ho! He pulled the most epic card. <laughs> yes, Petite Moth has been pulled from an EN pack. And that's hilarious, guys, because if you guys saw the video... We opened up the Forbidden Legacy. We pulled a Petite Moth EN. So we pulled one and then he sent us one. I actually got this before I opened those. But still pretty awesome that that popped up. Check out the Petite Moth. That's definitely going in the back right here. <laughs> that is great. And it's in a screw down. I love that. Not to mention a bubonic vermin. So that's pretty sweet. So thanks Yu-Gi-Oh! underscore TCG. Let's go into this one. I think I know what this one is. This is... Well, I'll just open it up. Here we go. So, in here we have... These are from Let's D -D -D Duel on Instagram. We have epic fake Yu-Gi-Oh! packs. So, we have Magic Ruler, Metal Raiders, and Labyrinth of Nightmare. They look hilarious. These are going to be for a future battle with Yu-Gi-Oh! Mo the next round when hopefully we don't get decimated. But yeah, these are going to be fun. We're going to open them up and see what craziness is inside. So yeah, that's pretty cool. We're going to open those up in the future. So I hope you guys are ready for that. It's going to be hilarious. See what is in those. Okay, next item. This feels like a deck box. So there's my address if you guys want to send to me. So far, we have the most epic card of all time. Besides Chicolates, of course. All right, here we go. We've got a note. Wow, Ruxin34, what is this? What is this? Oh, no. Wow. Wow. Hey Roxanne, I'm a huge fan as well. I've been watching your channel since the lockdown started and I've really enjoyed your openings. I've been going through some stressful things and your videos have helped me a lot. So thank you and in the package I've decided to send you all to send you my all-time favorite deck. There we go. Hope you enjoy it and please check out my YouTube channel. Thanks for reading this. Mr. Mimikyu. Mimikyu. That's how you say that. Mimikyu, right? Is that a Pokemon? The logo is a combo of Mimikyu and Venom. Okay, so that's pretty cool. So check out his YouTube channel, guys. Pretty cool. I'm assuming it's the same name. He didn't say, but here we go. His all-time favorite deck. This is this should be pretty awesome. Okay. Well, here we go. We got the extra deck first. It looks like uh oh gym knights. I loved gym knights. They were pretty cool in Duel Links when I played them. Check all these out. Secret Rares. Ruby Topaz. Surfinite. What else we got? Lapis Lazuli. Yeah, I remember that. Ooh, a nice secret rare. Millennium Eyes Restrict. And 2,000 eyes, so that's pretty cool. We got the main deck, which is the Gym Knights. 
Check out these sweet cards. Gym Knight deck. I mean, it's pretty awesome. I, I do I did play this in Duel Links for a little bit, and it was pretty fun. Rescue Rabbit. Block Dragon. Ghost Ogre and Snow Rabbit common. Pretty sweet. Absorb Fusion. Super Polys. Those are nice. Pot of Avarice. Unexpected Die. Okay, let's split these back up. All right, and then what's the end part? Just extra cards, I guess? Yeah. Obelisk the Tormentor. Oh, Secret Rare. Utopia the Lightning. That's cool. Crossroads Dragon. Shape Sisters. Shape Sister. We always pull that um, out of uh, Judgment of the Light. And there we go. Pretty cool. Phantom Knights. So pretty sweet. That's his favorite deck he sent us. So he sent us an entire deck. That is pretty crazy, guys. That is awesome. So make sure you guys check out his YouTube channel. Thanks again, Mr. Mimikyu, for sending us your favorite deck. That's really cool. Gym Knights. And I have actually played a Gym Knight deck, which is unusual because I rarely play Yu-Gi-Oh! So that's pretty cool that it was a deck I've actually, you know, had experience with. Where can I put this? Um, all right, we'll just leave it over here. Okay, last package for this video. This one was actually sent before I was officially doing mail day video. Like, this was sent, like, when I... I'm talking, like, months ago, guys. And it finally got here. So we're going to see what he sent us. This was, like... He told me he was going to send this ages ago, and he did. And then it was international, so it just took forever. Forever. Okay, here we go. Let's see what he sent. I don't even know what it's going to be, but he said open the mail. So, like, okay. All right. What could be in this epic package? That is the question. All right. There might not be a note in here. Okay, there are packs in here, guys. We're going to have an opening. Oh, wow. Oh, check this out. Millennium pack. Okay, that's sweet. Oh, my goodness. Look at all these packs. Okay, wait a second. First of all, the epic Red Dark Magician. This was my logo for the longest time. Now it still is, but it's a little bit different. But it was this one. That is amazing. That is so cool. Thanks for sending that. Then a Sealed Beast of Tower. I mean, that is awesome. That's from a tin, I guess. Because it says BPT, so. Is that from the Chaos Emperor Dragon tin? Don't they actually have that in, in the Chaos Emperor Dragon tin? I think they do. Oh, wow. Look at all these packs. Wow. Guys, we're about to... Oh, Thousand Eyes Bible? You can pull the ultimate rare um, Thousand Eyes out of that. Ancient Prophecy? Wow, guys. This is crazy. Oh, my goodness. World Superstars. Premium Gold? Whoa! He said it wasn't that much. Yeah, that's pretty... That's a lot. That's some good stuff. Okay. So, yeah, we're definitely going to open these. That's crazy. Okay, let's set these down. Let's do those crazy uh, Japanese awesome packs last. Let's do the English ones. And Because I know what's coming in these. Okay, World Superstars. Which one of these can you pull the... Uh, the one we pulled in the 10K special was the... Uh, or I guess in World Superstars you can pull all of them. It's the legendary dragon of white and the dark the dark one. Elements of Real Blaze Man. I guess the cards in the front. Okay, but I love how these look. They look so good. Okay. And I think what was his Instagram name's like Pokey Collector One or something like that? I can't remember exactly. So hopefully he will comment below. Yeah, there we go. That's that's pretty dope. High five the sky. Classic. Okay, wait, let's try not to ruin it this time. Yeah, World Superstars actually has those two dope cards in it because I opened it up in the 10K and I was like, eh, these are lame. And I was like, whoa, these are not lame. These are awesome. Okay, last World Superstars. Can we pull that Dark Magician? The, the, what, the What's Up Dark Magician? The WSUP, the What's Up. That's what I always say. Ooh, Neb Nebra Disc. Okay, that's pretty cool. Look how, sh these cards are so shiny. Look at them. That's pretty cool, actually. All right, we've got an Ancient Prophecy pack. We could pull a Ghoster out of here, which would be, you know, insane, obviously. But I would be okay with it. <laughs> I would be okay with it. Pseudo Space. Hydro Pressure Cannon. Okay, Absolute Power Force. I have not opened this pack in a while. The Majestic Red Dragon Ghost Rare. Hey, look. We've got our Majestic Red Dragon Ultimate Rare that we pulled. Make sure you guys go check out that video. That's an older video. That was back when we actually won pack battles and I was facing Yugi Mo. And I pulled the Ultimate Rare Majestic Red Dragon. That was awesome. Destruct Potion. Side Curse. Gravekeeper's Descendant. 
Informer Spy. Okay. All right, now we've got some uh, we've got some gold packs, guys. So that's really freaking awesome. Let's see what we can get. I've not opened much premium gold. I have obviously opened every pack. So, oh wait, are they at the front? Or are they all gold? I can't remember. Masked Hero Hanky, classic, bringing me back to Duel Links, as always. Yeah, you guys will make fun of me for saying that. Go Yo Guardian, nice, wait. Oh, Medolce Queen Tier Masu, that's cool. The Breeze Dragon. Rank out, wait, we pulled this in Ulti the other day, that's cool. From um, Lord of Tachyon Galaxy. Smashing Ground and Naturia Barkian, so that's pretty cool. Gold Rare Pack. All right. Premium gold. I do love the gold packs. They're fun. I used to hate them. I thought they looked awful. But they've grown on me. Oh my goodness. Like, these are crazy. They're so gold. Slifer! Yes! Yeah, Slifer the Sky Dragon. Oh my goodness. That's a good pull. I don't think that's an easy one to get. Bottomless. Nice. Mystical Space Typhoon. Judgment Dragon. Talk about a pack. Oh my goodness. Is that one bent? How is this one bent? That's crazy. In the middle of the pack. So we got a Slifer of the Sky Dragon. I can barely say Slifer because my tongue is killing me right now. Slifer of the Sky Dragon. There we go. Wow. That is amazing, guys. That is so awesome. Slifer. What a pull. Okay. So we've got all these. Let's open up this Millennium thing and see what's going on in it. Oh my goodness. Okay, I really need a knife for this, but I don't want to grab it. Okay, we got it, we got it. We got it, we got it. I'm saving the scissors because I know I'm not going to be able to open those Japanese packs. Just because, you know, it's me. And I can't open them, ever. Or Korean packs or anything. Anything that's not English, I can't open them. <laughs> okay, so there's a bunch of packs in here. I have no idea what this says. Somebody translate for me. I don't know what this says, so I don't know what we can get in here. So we're just going to open it. 20th Yu-Gi-Oh! It looks like it's a 20th anniversary thing. Let's see if we can use our aggressive feelings on these packs and open this thing up. Okay. Oh! Oh, it kind of worked. Check that out. Did you guys see that? I just opened that pack. Yeah, you see that? <laughs> yeah, give me some props, guys. I know what I'm doing. Oh, whoa. Look at these cards. Guilford the Lightning. Shrink, that's dope. Black Skull Dragon. Okay, these cards are awesome. Look at these cards. Is there like another rarity or are they all in this, uh, I don't even know what to call this rarity, this hieroglyphic rarity, I don't know. Oh, check that out. <laughs> so beautiful. Oh, we've got a nightmare wheel, guys. Look at this, I don't even need to be able to read the language. Five-headed dragon, scapegoat, go for the lightning. Oh, whoa, 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 that one looks different. Or does it? I feel like it looks different. That is the immortal Phoenix Raw or whatever it's called. Okay, I feel like this one looks different. I'm sleeping it up. That is insane. Check that card out. Wow. Wow. That is amazing looking. Oh, whoops. Be careful there. Don't kill the cards. Let's see if I can open it up again, guys. I've got this down. Like a pack opening pro over here. Oh, we got a feather duster. Harpy's feather duster. Okay. Beast skull. Um, illusion. Black illusion. Black illusion ritual. Okay. And a Zork. Dark Master Zork. Okay, cool. Next pack. Oh, failed. We failed that time. We'll get it, though. We'll get it. Nice. Nice. Well done, Ruxin. Well done. Ooh, we got Gandora. The Destruction something or something like that. Ring of Destruction with the old art. Relinquished. Shrink. Ooh, the Curse of Dragon. See, look. Wait, does that guy look different? No, I don't think so. The Curse of Dragonfire or something like that. See, look, I kind of know these cards. <laughs> the newer ones are a little bit harder. I, I know what they are, but I, I don't know their exact name. Because then they just get super long and more difficult to read. Okay. Give us fire. Here we go. Gandora. Bring a D. The Chaos Emperor Dragon. Check that card out. Five-headed dragon. Okay, I don't know this card, guys. What is this card? I don't know if I've ever seen this one. Is this in English? Let me know what that card is, because I don't even know. So that's pretty cool. For my first miss. But if it's not in English, then it doesn't count, because there's no way I could have known. <laughs> Another Relinquish. 
Uh, I can't remember that card's name. Something about Dark Magician or something. It's like Dark Magic something or something like that. Zork. Dark Renewal, I think. Ooh, that's cool. Black Luster Soldier. We're sleeping that up just because Black Luster Soldier, guys. Does this count? I found the Black Luster Soldier in my search um, because I never pulled Black Luster Soldiers. We don't pull the Collector Rare. We don't pull the IOC version. Pretty much never pull them. That's what it comes down to. Okay, oh, CED again. Scapegoat. Zork. Um, that's Star Renewal. Okay, I don't know this card either. I feel like these are Japanese exclusive. Looks really cool, though. I should probably pull these scapegoats out and put them in my uh, goat bulk, and we can play with those as gold, as <laughs> gold, as goat. That'd be pretty fun. Okay, wow, this is, uh, this is pretty fun. Not gonna lie, I like opening packs I've never opened and have no idea what they are. Makes it more interesting. Another B Skull. Looks like B Skull is pretty common in this set. Electromagnetic Turtle. That card I don't know. Gandora. Ooh, is this the the holding arms or something like that for the uh, Wing Dragon of Raw or the Raw Miracuse? I can't remember what it was called exactly. Okay, nice. Oh, the friendship. Is this Unity in Japanese? Hmm, I can't remember. Oh, Exodia. What is he called? Ex um, oh, I forgot. Shrink. Electromagnetic Turtle. And Nightmare Wheel. Okay, we're down to one pack left. So I don't know if there was a different rarity or not. Or maybe I just can't tell. I'm not really sure, but here we go. Gil for the Lightning. Scapegoat, nice. Beast Skull. Um, why do I always forget this? Black Losing Ritual. And Gandora. So that was pretty cool. Never opened that before, so that made that exciting. Some really cool stuff in there. Okay, let's do the Thousand Eyes Bible last because that's a pretty cool set. Okay, I don't know what this is. 20th Yu-Gi-Oh is what it says. Oh, no. Oh, no. We failed. These are a little bit harder than the last one. What's in here? Toon World. Come on. Enemy Controller. Insect Prince or Queen. And what's this guy? Embodiment of Apophis. Yep. Yep. Insect Princess is the IOC Ultra you will always get if you open IOC. Yeah, so... Not Insect Queen. Alright. This is a Zexal pack. I don't know that card, but it looks amazing. No. <coughs> wow. Photon something. As a hero, I don't know what it is. Or that, ah, uh, that's like Trident Dragon or something. And then that's a plant monster. I can't remember what it's called, but that's really nice looking. Those look amazing. Okay, premium pack 13. Yeah, when we get past the old stuff, I don't know them as well. You know, by name. Doing my best, though. I've never seen this card before. I don't think so, at least. Or, or these. That's a Vision Hero. Ooh, that's, uh... This guy's in Generation Force. His name's, like, Master Hero uh, Aqua or something like that. Okay, those look really sweet. I really love these Prismatics. They look really good. Okay, premium pack 12. We got it. Three packs left in this. Out of all these packs, so thanks again for sending these packs. This is so much fun. I love opening Japanese packs because I pretty much never do it unless you guys send them to me. So that's pretty sweet. Wow, look at that card. I mean, I just love that foil. It looks good. Wow, all kinds of lizards. Oh, Miracle Fusion, I think. Oh, what is that card? That looks amazing. Man, I, I just love these. They look so good. That is sweet. Okay. Collector's pack. This is an Arc V pack. So let's see if we can pull something cool out of Arc V. That's where our favorite set is, Dimension of Chaos, is Arc V. So I think it's the first Arc V set, actually. Am I right about that? I think it is. Or else it's it's definitely the first one, you know, with ghosts. Or last one with ghosts. So oh Mimi Mimi Cat. And a tune into your golem. That's cool. Okay, final pack from this these packs he sent me, which is awesome. Thanks again. Is a Thousand Eyes Bible. This one can pull the Thousand Eyes or Strix. That's pretty crazy. I don't really want to rip this one like that. Because, I mean, it's, oh, how do I cut this? I don't want to cut it. Can I open it like this way? Probably not because it's... Hey, it actually worked. Okay. All right, let's see what we can get out of here, guys. Thousand Eyes Bible. Can we get an old T? That'd be crazy. Wing Weaver, and we got Mad Sword Beast. We got a Gamble, I think. 
Island Turtle. And a Sword Hunter. That's a short print in PSV. So that's pretty cool. Basically a Pharaoh Servant set. So that's really awesome. These cards are really like sticky. It feels weird to open them. But yeah, thanks again for sending that. And all you guys who sent stuff for this mail day, that was a lot of fun. And it turned out to be longer than I thought because of all those openings we got to do. And if you guys want to send me something, P.O. Box is down below. It can be whatever you want. And it's a lot of fun. So thanks again for supporting the channel. I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Peace. All right, guys, I'm going to be adding this piece of mail onto our last mail day because this one came later, but I figured this should be in the viewer mail video. And by the way, yes, my lip is busted. I got elbowed in the face in basketball. Yeah, I know. I'm just, I'm getting destroyed every time. It's crazy. Just get in the face, bite the shoulder and the chin, you know, it's bad. But let's just get into what we're here for. This one's from Scott. Scott sent us an envelope, and I think there's something epic in here. I'm a little bit worried about what it could be because it's so epic. So what we're going to do is we're just going to open it up, see if there's a note, see what's going on. I think there's a note. There should be, right? Or maybe not. There isn't a note. Okay, there's just a top loader with cards in it, guys. He told me what it was. Let's see if we can not spoil. Okay. Okay. It's a big top loader, so hopefully the cards are right. Okay. Let's see what they are. Oh! Oh! He put them backwards. Okay, I like it. I like it. Okay. Oh my gosh, guys. What did he send us? What did he send us? Also, these are sweet top loaders for sending like multiple things. So it's actually really nice to have. What did he send us, guys? Oh my gosh. You guys see this? That's a collector's rare Blackluster Soldier. Oh my goodness. Look at the pattern on this. I have never owned one of these. Scott. You're insane. Like, what is wrong with you? Why did you send me this? Are you sure you want to send me this? Because if you don't, I will send it back. Because, I, I mean, if you don't want to send it to me, like, if, you, if you're having regrets or anything, because this is a beautiful collector's rare Blackluster Soldier Envoy of the Beginning. This is one that we never pulled. We pulled the Toon Blackluster Soldier, but we never pulled this one. Oh my goodness. I mean, talk about a legend, guys. Scott sent us a collector's rare Blackluster Soldier Envoy at the beginning. That is amazing. This looks so good. And not only that. Guys, he sent us two. He messaged me and he said, hey, have you gotten the cards yet? And I was like, nope, not yet. And at that point, I didn't know what he was talking about. Or I didn't know what cards. He just told me he was sending some. And I was like, nope, not yet. And he said, well, I sent you two collector's rare Blackluster Soldiers. And I was like, bruh. Bruh, are you kidding me? Two? Not one, but two. Like, that is insane. Like, all I can say is that, Scott, you are an absolute legend. These look incredible. And let me know in the comments. First of all, if Scott decides he wants them back, then that is fine. I will send them back. Because I feel kind of almost bad taking these because they, they're so awesome. But what should I do, guys? Should I grade these? Should we just put them in in a uh, in the viewer mail binder? Which, by the way, I'm gonna I'm gonna start. I have all of them all in one spot, but haven't put them in a binder yet. I'm thinking that I make a viewer mail binder, and then maybe we can do a video and show all you guys. So should this should these go in the binder just to bling out of the binder? Should we grade them? They are only unlimited, which I mean, obviously, I don't care because I mean, just send us block of soldiers. But I, when I'm, it, it might be a better binder card. I don't know, but I think it would be a lot of fun to send these in to get graded. See what they could get. That would be a lot of fun. I think we might do that. So let me know. Let me know what you guys think. So Scott, you're insane, first of all. Second of all, thank you. This is awesome. These these are probably the best looking collector's rares I've seen. I mean, just look at this. We gotta see this again. Look at the look at the spiral texture on there. Not spiral. Not, no, but it, it goes around. Okay. You know what I'm talking about. I mean that looks insane. Okay, it's getting really bright. That is insane. That is insane, guys. Yeah, so I couldn't leave this out of the mail day because he told me there were Black Luster Soldiers in there and I was like, whoa. Whoa, definitely. I'm not trying to downplay anything anybody else has sent. The craziest fan mail that we've gotten yet. And by the way, if you want to send P.O. boxes down below, you definitely do not have to send this level of stuff. This is crazy. This is awesome. So yeah, I'm super excited about this. Hey, we could even put these in a goat deck. Like when you play Goat Deck, you bling it out with the Collector's Rare. That's pretty cool as well. So, hope you guys did enjoy the video. I don't know where this is going in the video. Probably at the end. Maybe at the beginning. I don't know. But yeah, thank you guys for watching.
And um, let's continue on to the other part of the video. Oh! Yes. Okay, oh. Elemental Hero, Dark Bright. Boom! Oh! <laughs> 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 